Hey there! Today we're going to be picking up our dice and seeing how normal damage works in the Champions universe. And as you can see, I've got some hero models out here. Let's see if I can zoom in on them. And we're going to see how it looks like on the tabletop. And totally, totally excited to be here. All right. Let's go ahead and focus in, set our tripod, and get going. So in Champions, let's say you've made your character, and we're going to say, for example, that Seraphim here has a 10 dice energy blast. Three, six, yep, that's right, 10 dice energy blast. That's fair to middle in. Once you start getting up to 14 D6, 20 D6, those are huge amounts of damage, almost like uh, you know, that's kind of that hero's specialty to have that power and because that's the, that's a whole lot of blasting and Then these two dice. I'll explain what those do in just a second. So every attack does stun body and Knockback so these are different types of damage stun body and KB for knockback and they're relative, they're, they're very easy to calculate once you understand it. So let's roll our damage. So she blasts Galaxy Hunter, the alien. He's been, he's been on her trail for a long time. He's taken her in and now she's defending herself with a force blast of, uh, of telekinetic power. So here it comes. So you roll the dice and whatever is showing that's the stun damage. Now this is really low damage. So just for the sake of this experiment, I'm gonna re-roll that. Oh, now that's incredibly high damage. All right, well, this could be fun. Let's try this. So we just counted up by making groups, 10, uh, 20, and here's um, 18, 20, 40, 44 is the damage here unless I miscalculate. So the stun is 44 stun. And then body, what you do is every dice does one point of body damage, except if it's a six, it does two, and if it's a one, it does zero. So basically for rolling all these sixes, she went to one, two, three, four, she went to 15 body, but none for this one, so that would be 14 body. So basically, the body starts at just the number of dice, and you get a bonus here, and you get a penalty there. So she did 14 body, and then now you take two dice, and you would roll this all at the same time. You roll two dice, and subtract, so 14 minus seven, which is an average roll, and the knockback is seven uh, inches. So you would, every inch is two meters, so this would be 14 meters of knockback. So you just go directly away. In fact, can, will this show that? Let me move this a little bit. So he would, he'd be knocked back seven inches because of the force of the blast. In fact, this is actually a very, if she had got just average body, it would have only been uh, three knockback. So basically, in fact, he's, he's off camera now. Now, damage is like this. You have, everybody has what's called energy defense and physical defense. Now, an energy defense and physical defense of uh, 15 would be kind of low, 25 would be kind of high average, and uh, if you went all the way up, if you had 40, defense in both, that would make you immune to most attacks or take very little damage from most attacks. So let's say Galaxy Hunter has 20 right in the middle and it's an energy attack, so it'd be energy defense. So minus 20, you just subtract from each one. So he would take 24 stun and zero body because of course his def it couldn't get past his defenses. So it's very unlikely to get actual physical damage. And again, this is, this is like a superhero system. So it's very unlikely to actually take 
physical damage that you could die from. But stun, stun is like getting knocked out and you can actually recover this relatively easily. But for body, you're going to have to go to the hospital for that or have some kind of extraordinary power. Okay, so in five minutes I taught you how to do normal attacks in the Champions universe.